Welcome to the first episode of Between the Trailers. I'm your host, Robert Cook. With me today, my first guest, Hayden Salas. Yeah, the check my name. You're forgettable. Fine. Second. So, Hayden, tell, tell the people a little bit about yourself. Yeah, that's what I figured today. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about you. Let's start with the nickname. Mr. Second Place. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's second place. I didn't give myself that name. Oh, well, why don't you win? <laughs> because um, I don't want to, you know, hold someone's feelings. Okay, you're just save, saving, saving grace for now. Yeah. Okay. I'm, wait, I'm waiting for, like... Uh, That's what I'd say, too. Yeah, I'm waiting for one of those extra extra money things where there's, like, a bunch of people. Oh, no, cash days? The bit yeah. Cash got that? Yeah. Okay. Well, what bunch of people? This this was quoted to you saying that you're better than everyone else except me. What's that like? Uh, it's pretty frustrating. I'm not better than you, but everyone else is pretty fine. Well, so you're just better than everyone you've ever been. Every, everyone I've ever been, except for you. That's awful. A lot of confidence from somebody who's nicknamed Mister Second Place. I mean, you're first place. I saw it. So, what's your favorite thing about racing RC cars? Being everyone but you. That's all you got? Uh, I do, I do like to go and hang out with people. It's the social aspect of it. Yeah. I mean, I'm not doing much to go there for something. Um, wow. <laughs> One thing you're notoriously known for, besides second place, is red light all the time. Is there a theory behind that, or are you just that? I'm just too good that I can't, I can't, you know, there's, there's so much room for hell, and I'm so good that that room for hell is not even conceivable. So you suck. Yeah, that's too. Okay. I mean, you could, you could say it like that, I mean. I mean, that's. How many full space have you got at drag racing? This year? Yeah. Seven. There's no way we've got to stop. Well, they go with my arm. This year, they go with my arm. So, back to racing. What made you go with the smaller, the little C Mini? Uh, a 10th scale. It doesn't break as much. In the, well, your mechanic makes the difference. It doesn't break as bad as the big car. I really side thing. It's quicker than you fix that than the other one. It's also Lionel when I take it off the stand. Um, I don't whip everything off the table. I, I like it small. Just what you used to handle it? That's it. Okay. Um, what's with the, the paint scheme, the Oreo colors? The black and white? Yeah. Black and white, white looks good. Just the, just the color preference? Plain and simple? Like the mind? Uh, one last question, just um, you know, before we get really into it. Uh, there's been rumors floating around that you're Andre the Giant's illegitimate child. You want? You got any anything to address on that? <laughs> uh, I don't think I am, but because the hair, the height. When did he die? I don't know. Last night's just... guess. All right. Well, no, because if, if these are rumors, all right. Well, well, if these are rumors, and you're going to ask me about rumors, then you should do your research before you ask. As a good host, you should do research. Well, there's not much research to be done without you. So what? You're junior in high school. I'm going in my junior year. You're going in junior year. You got any aspirations besides finishing second to qualify? Start finishing shoot ball. Start finishing first. You got any, any aspirations outside of racing? Um, Besides not getting jobs? Yeah, my license. Hopefully I pass that test for a child. As long as you do better than you do at RC racing. I mean, that's, a little, that's a little different. I mean, they're both cars. Yeah, but one's that side. And that, I'm well, just going to say. I'm going to say. giant genetics built in. You know, I mean, all cars are small. 
I mean, not really. There's like semis and stuff. What's a car? It's a vehicle. It's a truck. It's a vehicle. It's a commercial truck, but we want to get real specific. What's going on? If I could take and use a truck to take my advantage, so. Why would you do that? You like smaller cars. We've already talked about that. Why would you use I, a truck? So I don't like smaller cars driving with my leg hole. I'm tall. Because of the giant G. It, you know what this is? Uh, Solo? It sounds like you get your hair ready in the morning. It's, I just, you just woke up like that. No. That I, makes sense. I comb it. I comb it. But I, after I take a shot, I'll comb. Like a bristle? A brush. I take like an SOS. I do a brush. It's a wet brush. Wet brush? Yeah, I just comb it. It doesn't look like it. Well, that's because, uh. Is it the I, giant G? I was sitting. So if it, it holds up by itself. So you brushed your hair bad because you were sick. No, I wasn't pushed. It's uh, when I sit, my head pressed, so the hair was drying, pressed together. It sounds like a lot of abuse. Just like you have on race day. Yeah, yeah. Who's your favorite person to be? Um, I really don't have a favorite person to be. No, I don't. It's depending on how much, like, like I grandpa or grandma. I feel or... I feel the same amount of joy. Being Sean and Grandpa, depending on if they were struck in trash before. I mean, it's okay. So it's just case by case. It's case by them. Yes. Do you take pride in beating up on older men and women? Yeah. Some smaller children? Yes. Yes, I do. But they talk trash, yeah. I feel bad if they don't. I mean, I tell, tell them, good job. Well, the butterfly. Joe. Are you ready for the point series to start? Yeah. You excited about that? I'm pumped. Yeah, that second place check going to look good on your wall, isn't it? It, it will, actually. It will, we're going to get it fine. I'll bet you. That'll be about yeah. I can look at this flat check. I can do Yeah, that's, I'm sure that's in your unemployed budget. I mean, I'm about to no, no, no. So how does it feel being the third favorite child? The third favorite child? Yeah. Well, my mom and dad? Anybody, really. Third favorite child? I mean, obviously it doesn't matter because I didn't even realize I was the third favorite child. So. Is that oblivious to it? Yeah. I mean, you, and this is on record, I, I can quote you. You said I was your favorite nephew. Well, yeah. I love you. I'm just saying, you know, oh. other. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, you're number one to me. Just you're number two to everybody else. I thought she said I was number three. Okay, you got me. You're worse than I said you were. Sorry. Exactly. Wait, what? Well, hey, it's Mess- been good having you on the show. It was oh, my very. Hopefully, you'll never be here again. We don't have Probably. to do this all over again. Probably. Um, I mean, depending well, on what you get. Catch us on the next episode, uh, which will be here in a couple hours. Yeah. Or I'll get Grandma out here so she can sweat to death. That's not, yeah, that's going to be nice. I'll probably get bit by a whole spot. Mm-hmm. Hey, they, they like biting oil. People eating me, though. Like skin. The blood's richer after so many years. It's like a fine wine. Oh. Anyway, that's it.